was the yeah. experience. And, uh, Loved it. I mean, I was down a deck lower with when I was a kid, but first time up here on the top, certainly a momentous occasion for me, for the club, for Taylor, for Christian, for the fans, for everybody. We're in view of Memorial Stadium right there, which is kind of cool, and just this beautiful flag flying overhead. It's, it's perfect. What are your thoughts on the new logo? Love it. Love it. It's still got the Space Needle, iconic, you know, Puget Sounds right here. All of the work that Taylor and the crew did to incorporate everybody in this decision-making process, I think it's super cool. Did you have any input in the design? Well, I filled out the form for sure. I did the questionnaire. Obviously, I was involved in some of the talks, but I left most of that to the experts. When you first saw it, was there any nostalgia? Yeah, when, when, this morning at 10 o'clock when they started rolling out the videos, Jada, it was super cool. A little tear to my eye with a two-minute clip of how they, you know, all of the old photos and film of Jimmy Gabriel and some of those people. It was, it was good. Loved it. But you were next to Christian Roldan and Taylor, and this about in you is about the history of the soccer in the yeah with the Seattle Sounders. That's a great question, Felipe, because uh, I'm the old guy. NASL, Taylor, A League, USL, Christian, MLS. So three really good representation of of all of the teams from the Sounders from years past and now the present mentioned the A-League there, bringing back uh, the Orca. What are your thoughts on yeah. bringing back uh, Sammy? I mean, it's great. I know Bernie and Dick and Neil Megson and all the, that crew, they'll be happy. Dick McCormick, my good buddy. So it's it's all good memories. Have you talked with any, any of your former guys yet about you know, the new logo? And they're, they're no. Uh, when I'm done here, Jackson, I'm sure, and tonight at the big unveiling at Mopop, uh, you know, we'll, we'll talk about it. There's going to be a bunch of the old guys there, so it'll be fun. You know, I saw your video with the, about the coronation, sort of explaining the history behind that. Uh, are, are you sort of excited to be able to tell, be able to tell that story again? And sure. I know we've been using it, but... Yeah. I mean, there's so much history with the club, Jeremiah, that, you know, my story, uh, the coronations, uh, Sammy, Orca, players. I mean, there's a lot of different stories encompassing over 50 years. Pepe Fernandez, Dave Gillett, some of those guys that are still hanging around, Alan Hinton. Uh, you know, it's there's so many stories I can't mention them all, but they're all good ones. Uh, last four games. Uh, what are your thoughts on, on the last four games? Yeah. Big opportunity, big opportunity to you know increase our playoff position. You know, make sure we t finish in the top four. That would be what we're shooting for. Uh, but obviously, they're going to be some tough games. But you know, we've got two at home, two on the road. So we're 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 positive. How's Raul doing? Raul's doing fine. He's back in full training, so he'll be available for Nashville.